So now Donald Trump is tweaking out over the crowd sizes at the rallies. <laughs> That's funny. We're all laughing at you now, Donald, and you have God to hate it. <laughs> anyway, Donald Trump is tweaking on these crowd sizes because he's always viewed the crowd sizes at the rallies as an indicator of who's winning. And he's always drawn in these huge crowds that were, you know, cheering loudly and everything for him. So if you recall in the last election, he would harp on that all the time. He would say how he knew he was winning based on the size of the crowd. So now that Kamala Harris is blowing him out. The crowd size is like blowing him out. There's no comparing the two. So while Trump goes to rallies that are shrinking with each rally, there's less people at each rally. There is far less than he's ever seen. And now, now there's there's mixed 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 roars with boos in the crowd, and it's bothering him because he sees all this space, all these empty seats. Well, he has to turn and look to Kamala Harris's rallies and see how she's blowing it out. Packing crowds, standing room only, people waiting outside, the whole lot of it. So when Donald Trump sees these crowd sizes, he sees it as an indicator of himself losing. Loser. And it bothers him. It truly, truly bothers him that he's shrinking, he's shriveling. He's, he's just falling away. Less and less people attending his rallies while more and more are supporting Kamala Harris at hers. And not only that, but the polls are showing it too. Every indicator that there is is, is showing her, her taking off, skyrocketing while he's plummeting in the exact same direction at the exact same rate. The rate at which she's going up, he's going down. And he can't handle this free fall. Because to Donald Trump, that's the truest indicator to him of who's winning. And if you go back and you look at the last election, how much he harped on that. How much he played to that. How much he believed that the size of his crowds... Was 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 him winning when that wasn't the case? <laughs> it was never the case, and now it's bothering him to the point where he's just rambling on, just going off on these tangents that just go from one thing to the next. It's like a child in grade school, a bully in grade school. This name calling and there's no substance. It's just all hate filled and vile. And you don't know how to act. His mind is demented because he too, like his father, suffers Alzheimer's and dementia. And with all of this pressure that is being applied to him, because remember something, he loses, he goes to prison. He faces all of these criminal prosecutions and there is no stopping it. <laughs> Boo! Bye, Trump.